Hi, I'm Ben, and I'm a rising senior at the Drew School, and this is my second milestone on my omnidirectional robot. So what I did was I connected my PS2 controller to these motors, and I can move them either individually or all together. And I can have them move in both directions, both clockwise and counterclockwise. Um, and what I did was I uh, connected the motors to the motor controllers and then connected those motor controllers to uh, the breadboard which then has its power, ground, and voltage for each of the controllers. And I connected that to my Arduino and the battery. The Arduino is so I can actually write the code to allow the motors to work with the controller and the battery to actually provide power because the motors take up too much battery, take up too much power, and the Arduino can't supply all of, all of that by itself. So the next thing I'm planning on doing is actually making the chassis for the robot, and I'm going to put all three wheels from 120 degrees apart from each other, and I'd have to rewrite some code, do some trigonometry. So if I were to say go forwards, it, I'd all the wheels will have to move in a specific way so that the entire robot as a whole would then move forwards and be the same for all the rest of the directions. Yeah, thank you.